my case say 2025 aspirant so uh, verification slip is already downloaded like many of you have already downloaded and there is so many discrepancies regarding that and before about which I have cleared in my last video right. So KEA has told that you don't have to go to the KEA office in person there can be editing online right. So in this video I will be telling you how you can edit your verification slip ok. So this is a final chance and the last chance that is given to you for the edi uh, editing your verification slip if any type of mistakes are there you can edit it and that is how you how to do in this video I will talk about that ok. So if you are someone whose verification slip has some problem please watch the complete video it is going to be very very important. So first of all uh, you have to go to the KEA official website and there you can see this UGCT 2025 online application editing link ok. So this link was activated on 30th only but now it is modified. So you have to click on this link and once you click on this link you will be finding your uh, login details. So just put down your registration number, password, your captcha and click on login using OTP or if you have face ID you can use any of them and then click enter then you will be directed to this page. Now here there is three types of editing that you can do. The first one is just a minute, uh, okay. The first edit required is if there is any RD details update, okay. RD details means your uh, registration department number, okay. So any income certificate, RD number, caste certificate number, any number you have written wrong because of which your certificate is not verified, that type of details if you want to change. Ne next is reservation claims update. For example, there are reservations for Canada medium, for rural studies, right. There are different, different reservation. If you have forgotten to claim any reservation or if you want to change uh, the claim of any particular reservation you have to click on this you can have more you can have both of them also okay and then if there is any special category claims for defense and all there are some special category claims that also if you want to update you can update okay so first you will see the first one that is rd details update so if you click on this the page will open like this and you can see here uh, you can see uh, here this one that is uh, three types of income NCLC and HK is there ok. These are the details that is given income NCLC, HK and religious minority. You can select any one for example if you have selected income and then you have to I will show you here. You can just put down your RD number here and submit ok. This blank is there to submit your RD number. Next we have uh, reservation claims update. So you can claim for uh, Canada medium if you have rural study or linguistic minority or KKR that is Kalyana Karnataka region and you have to click on update reservation then your reservation will be claimed for that. Now uh, there is special category also you can see NCC sports, uh, scouts and guides, defense, ex-defense, physically disabled, Anglo-Indian, central armed police force, ex-central armed police force. Any of these clear reservation if you have you can also claim that. So if you uh, select any spe special category for example NCC you have to enter your certificate details here ok. Certificate details means generally any RD number or certificate number should be there that you have to enter and here you can see what all reservations you have claimed ok. So if you have claimed any of the reservation just check here that it is showing claimed and you have given the supportive documents for that ok. So yes students that is all in this video and I hope that you won't have any doubt in the editing of your application form now onwards you can edit it accordingly ok. So that is all and thank you for watching all the very best for your counselling process if you have any doubt please put down in the comment section we will definitely address to it.